there's a lot of ways to slack off on the treadmill. Oh my God, I have to stop for a minute. My shoe, to retie it. Actually, I've raised wasting time on the treadmill to an art form. Well, so I told her I was bringing the cheesy potatoes and that I get there and she has cheesy potatoes. I mean, we don't need that many cheesy potatoes. And I did, I mean, I told her. There he goes. Ciao. Oh, I hate this white bird. That is so many vowels. I just like to have a little something on. A little lip gloss, you know. Hey, I think I went to high school with that guy. Do I look older? He looks older, right? I think it's so nice that J-Lo and Mark Anthony are still friends. I think it's tendonitis us a little bit. It really hurts. Oh, oh my God, I'm sweating. Gotta hydrate. This water is not cold enough, I'll be back. I turned to an expert trainer to get more out of my treadmill time. Here are Travis the trainer's treadmill tips. Upon seeing my form, we get tip okay, one. First off, I was asked if you're okay, because you know, if somebody like that, they could be dehydrated or whatever the case, too exhausted, and then it's time for them to take a little bit of a break. But if you're just doing that, that I wasn't actually dying. absolutely. Once you're okay, you know, I'd ask, you know, what, what is it that you're trying to, 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 to achieve by doing this type of um, exercise right here? And then, and if I would ask you that, you would tell me I what? I would say I would like to um, just be even more smoking hot than I am right now. Okay. That's right, hands off the machine. They stand straight up so we're not taking off all that. Take okay. your hands off of them pedals and just go ahead and if you want to stay at that pace, this is how you're going to want to do it, okay? Don't okay. be slouching over all and don't, right. be, don't be trying to get a break if you need Then go faster and get that heart rate up. Get going at that pace comfortably for about, you know, a minute to two minutes. Once you're there comfortably, I want you to go ahead and up that speed to uh, maybe a full point extra. So if you're at 3.8, try to go up to 4.8, see the difference. Travis, the trainer says fast and then slow again for the entire up workout. Up Absolutely, and up and down, heart rate up, heart rate down, heart rate up, what we like to call interval type training. Then up the incline to burn more. Up to 10 to 15, without holding on for about an hour, you can burn for about 500, maybe up to 1,000 calories, depending on the speed that you do adjust it to. With so, the incline? Absolutely. And here's an idea, so walk backwards. And I'm gonna bump your incline up a few points, okay? okay. I'm just gonna go up to five right now. What's so you can see, just at that pace, a little bit different, okay? You're gonna have a whole whole lower body workout all at the same time, just by a little bit of incline, so by walking here backwards. Is like that? Boom, just like that, okay? What and you're gonna mean? work inner and outer thighs if you do that way. Finally. There's a cool down button on most treadmills, most machines. Just hit the cool down button and it'll bring you down at the mo at the best pace. According if you to follow what? Travis's treadmill tips, you'll avoid spinning your wheels. There's like nowhere to sit down in here. 